Now let's uh, have a look at how we do the hand wraps with the, um, the bandages that we supply as part of the kit when you join the academy. Now, with this here, because it doesn't have a loop, we need to make a loop. So what we're going to do is just get our thumb finger, just drive a loop here into the end of the bandage right there, you see? Okay. Now I want to expand that out so that um, I can get my thumb into it. So, that there. so now you see I do exactly as we did before. I'm just going to bring my thumb through the loop here. So now take it out and around your wrist. Now, because of the width of the bandage and the length of it, we're going to take this straight up. Now, so we come around the wrist here. And we're going to just take it straight over from the thumb side over to the little finger side. Put it around that little finger and bring it back to here, like so. Yeah. Now we're going to come around the wrist to here, like so. Come straight off the wrist now, up and through the thumb. So we come around the back of the thumb up over here. Again, we're going to go around that wrist. This time we go straight up. Going around the wrist as we did before, we're going to go straight up around the next finger from the little finger side of it here. We're going to come back through, down through the middle, and over to the thumb side of the wrist again. There. Once again, we go around the wrist here. So I'm trying to keep as much width in this bandage as I can so that we get as much effect on the wrist itself. And we still want to try and keep that little bit of rigidity there to stop the fist bending down too much. So we want to give this a little bit of firmness here. Come around the thumb side, back over, back and through the thumb. Once more, around the wrist, and come back up, and now around that middle finger right there, down, coming back to the thumb side, I'm going to go around, now when we come back off this one, we come back off the little finger side, we go back up, over and round the index finger. So we come from the outside of the index finger, back to the inside, and come back around the wrist here. At this point, we want to go back through the thumb and come down here. So Come to the wrist again. Now we just go around the wrist, take out the slack, put some firmness in there at the end. Generally, all we need to do here, or if, if we've got a bit of tape or something here just to bind that in, it's, it's good. We'll just take an end and just slip that under in your wrist. Right there, just buried underneath. Right there. And it holds itself in quite nicely. Okay. Just pop this over the end, it quite often comes off the little finger. But again, you have a good, firm, solid hand right there, locked into position for you. Do it well for your training. And once again, we'll do this in slow motion so you can see it. So remember, firm, not too tight, not too loose. You want to have it firm so it gives some, some good, solid structure to the fist. And when you're holding your fist, your fingers in here, thumbs on the top, so a good structure there, and not too tight such that it shuts off your circulation. Enjoy your training.